I'm Melissa McCauley at City Hall, where city officials have provided the latest COVID-19 numbers, saying there are no new cases to report at all 10 city-run long-term care homes. Now, this comes as good news today as the province has now made it easier to visit loved ones at long-term care. Up to two visitors can now see residents through indoor pre-scheduled visits under certain conditions. Visits are now allowed so long as a home isn't experiencing an outbreak. All visitors must also have a negative COVID-19 test taken within the past two weeks. Indoor visitors will be provided with a surgical mask that must be worn at all times. In terms of the latest COVID-19 numbers, city officials say there are now 58 new cases over the past two days. I hope that residents living in long-term care and their families see this as a step forward. And I know our city officials are working hard to make sure that as many protections are, are in place as possible ahead of any second wave. In terms of the latest COVID-19 numbers here in the city, city officials say there are now 58 new cases of COVID-19. There are 15,202 cases of COVID-19 in the city, an increase of 17 cases since yesterday. There are 108 people hospitalized with 24 in ICU. In total, 13,584 people have recovered from COVID-19. To date, there have been 1,141 COVID-19 deaths in Toronto. Dr. Eileen Davila says new infections are still being reported with more cases now affecting 20 to 39-year-olds with infections coming from indoor private gatherings. Both Davila and Mayor John Tory warn if this continues among younger populations, we could experience setbacks. I'm very concerned about this, given recent trends amongst this age group in other jurisdictions. I'm also concerned because I've heard that many people say that they believe that COVID-19 is over. I'm here today to tell you that this is simply not true. Let's focus on something very important. COVID is not over. There is no summer vacation from COVID-19, much as we might want to have one. So while the urge to party and get together with friends and family may be strong, especially with younger people here and across the province, please keep following public health advice. As we wait for the approval to move into stage three of the province's recovery plan, Toronto Public Health says they have asked the province to consider enhanced safety measures for restaurants and bars. And Mayor John Tory is asking apartment and condos to consider adopting face covering policies in common areas. Now he says that most apartments have agreed to do this, but if people are not complying, he says he will look into potential bylaws.